platform plant-based soul. So now I introduce Joshi. E. I just want to start today by reading something that I wrote the night after being in a piggery. It can be hard to breathe when you see what others cannot see. I gazed into the eyes of a mother who was helpless, trapped in the dark with her babies just born. I picked up one of her babies and the mother screamed at me, eager to put her baby down and let her go as if I was going to hurt her. I wasn't one of them paid workers that were going to harm you. The scream still rings in my ears like a constant, constant shattering glass being broken over and over again. I couldn't believe what I was witnessing in these moments and to think all these mothers will be slaughtered, all these babies will be killed soon enough. A lot were already dead, many bruised and battered as they looked lost, confused and empty laying on these cold concrete floors. How is this still happening in 2018? All I know is that I'm trying, and many others are too. All I know is that I'm sorry, and many others are sorry too. We are sorry, and we are trying. I'm sick and tired of trying to convince people that slitting an animal's throat is wrong. Of seeing trucks full of damaged souls on the way to a slaughterhouse. I'm sick and tired of hearing pigs screaming in gas chambers. Of seeing baby male chicks chopped up alive in the egg industry. Of witnessing the disgusting horrific reality of the dairy industry and all the unimaginable horror of all the abuse in the harming industries. I'm sick and tired of walking through a morgue in the supermarket. Of the propaganda that the industries perpetuate. One example, images of happy animals. Come on. In reality, they all get bred into existence to be used and killed. I'm sick and tired of the violence. I'm sick and tired of those who turn a blind eye. I'm sick and tired of the lies and I'm sick and tired of the suffering. We have been lied to so much. Industries have led us to believe that we need to consume the body parts and fluids of other beings in order to be healthy. That we need to wear their skin or fur to make a fashion statement or to use them for entertainment. We all know we can be happy and healthy without harming others. And for those that are unaware, will soon come to realize that harming animals is unnecessary. Last year, I went on a mission to rescue some animals that were bred for slaughter and profit. I'll never forget the baby piglet I held in my arms that night. He was shaking and trembling in fear. As I held him towards my chest, I could feel his heartbeat throbbing. I looked at, it, I looked at his mother and she was trapped and confined these behind bars. She had no room to turn around and she could barely stand up. In these moments, I wondered how on earth we as compassionate human beings have the audacity to breed innocent, sentient individuals into life to be used and killed for no reason that could be justified. So what is speciesism? Speciesism is an assumption that human animals are superior to non-human animals, therefore giving us the right to exploit them, abuse them, and take away their most precious gift, life. It is the belief system that some lives matter more than others. And this belief system is a problem of all that is wrong in the world. But despite all the darkness, I look around and I see so many things that give me hope. Look at all of us here today. This is the fastest growing social justice movement in history. I see people getting active and using their voice to speak up for animals. 
Times are changing, and it's only a matter of time before more people wake up and make kinder choices. We cannot stop right now. We have to keep driving this movement for the animals, for the planet, for everything. I remain hopeful. We remain hopeful. And we must never give up hope. For as long as we have a voice, we will use it. For as long as we are aware of such horror and destruction towards animals, we will continue to fight for their liberation. Let us feel all the emotions we need to feel and use every emotion to fuel our motivation and desire to help them. United we stand for total animal liberation.